Hey learners, I'm Mr. Saul, and as part of our lesson on light, I wanted to do a little experiment called the light tunnel. So what I've done is I've got a few pieces of cardboard here. This piece of cardboard doesn't have any holes in it. These three pieces of cardboard do have holes in them. And what we're going to do is we're going to set these up in a line so that I have one in front, then one behind, one behind that, and I'll have the holes all lined up through all three and then we're going to shine a light and we're going to make some observations that happen of what happens when the light shines through these holes so we're going to be making four observations today and i'm going to read them out i have my notes right here so the first observation is we're going to draw what we see on the big rectangle when i first shine the light on it without the three holes in front okay so you can see that here how i'm shining the light on the big rectangle all right, so let's pause and you guys can share your observations about what you see. Okay, our next one is you're going to draw what you see on the big rectangle as I move the light backwards. Again, this is without the holes in the way. So here I am moving the light backwards away from that big rectangle. All right, so this will be a good place to pause and share your findings, your observations. Next up, what I've done is I've lined up my three pieces of cardboard with the holes so that they're all in a straight line. Now I'm going to shine the light through the three holes. And we can pause here and you guys can share your observations of what you see. Alright, and finally, here I am moving the light backwards through the three holes. And as I move it back, does anything change? What do you notice? Now let's talk about our conclusions. Can you describe what happened when the light changed position, both with and without the three holes in the way? On a separate piece of paper, or maybe on your whiteboard, can you draw the path of the light coming from the flashlight without the three holes in the way? What did that beam of light look like? All right, and next, on that same whiteboard, can you draw a picture of what the path of the light looked like as it was going through the three pieces of cardboard with the holes in the way? Did it look the same? Did it look different? I wonder why. Final question, or another question. What would happen is, what would happen if I had my three holes lined up, but I had one hole that was set off to the side like this, maybe the middle one? What would happen in that case? Would the path of light still go straight? Please share your thoughts. All right, my friends, I hope you enjoyed this little experiment and there will be lots of other experiments that we'll be doing throughout the year and I will see you guys next time.